Hi everyone, this is Edward. Welcome to VideoProc official channel. In this series, we will introduce you the cutting skills that are extensively used in movies and vlogs. Make sure you check out the link in the description box down below to download the software for free. Alright, so now, let's get the video started. In this video, we will talk about one of those essential cuts, jump cut. I hope this could help you with your video editing. Jump cut is different from the standard cut that people usually use for continuous narrative. It is always used to express the state of characters and to represent the mood of the films. Besides, in order to improve the rhythm of the video, many YouTubers prefer to use this kind of cutting technique to cut off the parts that they are not satisfied with, especially for those videos that people need to appear on camera. Now, I will show you how to apply jump cuts in three different ways by using VideoProc Vlogger. People usually record the whole process of cooking when they are making a cooking video. As a result, the video can be pretty lengthy and bored without any cut. At this time, jump cuts are required to extract the sense of the video and improve its consistency. First of all, create a new project in VideoProc. Import the footage that you would like to edit and drag it into the video track and then you just need playhead and split those two tools to finish the editing. Now, move the playhead and find the essential parts that you want to present in the video. Cut the clip into parts by using split. And then, delete those parts that you don't want to show in your video. The rest clips will stick with each other automatically. Let's preview the video. And here you go, a nice cooking video. Of course, jump cuts can be used in many sports videos as well. For example, we can try to edit this basketball playing video by using this technique. Import the footage that you would like to edit. Let's drag the footage into the video track and cut off the process of dribbling. The outcome will be more fluency and attractive. Another function of the jump cut is to show the passing of time, and this can express the state and the mood of the characters. We can clearly feel that the guy in the video is suffering from the boredom of waiting, and it is pretty easy to achieve this effect by using a jump cut. Let me show you how to do this in VideoProc Vlogger. First of all, import those two footages into VideoProc Vlogger. Drag them into the video track. Let's preview what this video looks like without any jump cut. It will be so lengthy and meaning repetitive, and people can barely keep watching it. However, it will be a huge difference if we only keep the main content. And delete the rest. Using the tricks of jump cut can make your vlog more brilliant. Now, let me show you how to do this. Import all the footages into VideoProc. And place them in order. After that, use split to edit the clip and only remain the key scenes. Then, import another rhythmic music as a background music and place it into the audio track. Next, find the trumpet icon on the left side of a video track. Click it to mute the original sound of the video. In order to make the change of scene more rhythmic, you can click the audio icon to open the audio editor panel, select analyzer, and let the software help you mark all the music beats automatically. 
Another way you can do is to play the preview directly and add markers to the clip based on your temper perception. After that, use the mouse to drag the fragments to align them with the markers. Finally, let's take a look at the finished video. Alright, now you've reached the end of today's video about Jump Cut in Video Proc Vlogger. I think you have got a comprehensive understanding to it. Don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you in our next tips. Hope you enjoy. Bye.